welcome dear students we are learning technique to solve simple harmonic motion problems and here we were doing the last class we have calculated length of center pendulum when uh, time period is given and the length is asked so here is another problem calculate the length of a second pendulum here it is length of second pendulum having time period that is two second value of this you will be 9.8 meter per second square if you try to understand this problem this type of the problem so it becomes very interesting and very simple as well when you look at the basic requirement asked during the problem basic requirement is that you are asked to calculate length of a pendulum which pendulum for second pendulum then you have to decide you have to think about what will be the time period for the case of second pendulum here the time period of the second pendulum will be two seconds a type of the pendulum whose time period is two seconds that type of pendulum is called second pendulum. Sometimes some scientific or uh, logical questions are asked. You must give the answer with the logic. And if the time period of a simple pendulum is two seconds, then that type of simple pendulum is called second pendulum. So the rest of the values are given. Value of G, you are asked to calculate length of that pendulum at that time. It means that t that is equal to 2 pi root l over g. So we have to simplify it. How will you simplify t is here, taking the square on both sides? So here it is 4 pi l over g and make it simplified to the other value of length. That will be equal to g here you are multiplying it going to the other side it will be here you are dividing it will be multiplied to the other side or we are multiplying on both sides with g it will be g t square here it is then here is 4 pi we are dividing on both sides with 4 pi so it's l is equal to g t square divided by 4 pi time period is given you have Use your sense to find the value of time period when it's second pendulum is two. So after putting the value g is constant, put the value of the time period for the second pendulum, put the rest of the val all values of the constant, you are getting length of simple pendulum. So it's 0.992, simply it's almost approximately one meter. So this shows that if you are asked to calculate length of second pendulum then you must understand what will be the time period of that, that second pendulum. Time period will be two seconds then because it's second but And the length figure that you will calculate that will be approximately equal to one minute. Thank you very much.